All right, the final Yeezy Doom game that's not going to try. Just like the others, it seems like this game pauses when you are not in the focus of the game. I don't know why is this a Yeezy Doom thing. Um, I'd like to not have it paused when I'm not in focus of the game. Yeah, it is. It is pausing. Um, looks quite different than normal Yeezy Doom games. Again, you have the classical kind of looking, you know, menu here. Supporting the same kind of, you know, resolutions. Also custom resolutions. Again, I don't know if 32 by 9 resolutions will vertically crop or not. Lots of settings here. Um... Good, nice little settings here. A bump the saturation up a little bit. And of you, Bob, and screen shake. Nice. Nice that you can have uh, effects AA and stuff like that. Crosshair, nice. I can have my nice little green crosshair and use the size of it. Uh, scale the hub if you want to do that. Always run nice. No water in here. We also have the full options menu, which is kind of crazy here. <laughs> Ooh. Multi sample 32, as I've added myself here. That's not here, you, you know. It's not, it doesn't have a custom menu, like options menu, it just have the easy doom kind of menu here tweaked a little bit but yeah let's get to the game very different gc doom but it looks more like a gc doom traditional kind of game here hard normal easy let's go with easy for the last just find a demo um Let's tweak it down a little bit. Interesting the blip blop music, very retro style there. Need to open doors. That was a nice little stutter there. The why? Did all three keys. Uh, very different. Looking for sure. Hello, come on. Come on. Okay. Okay. Yeah, I think I like this more. Uh, need a yellow key. Green key? No? Okay. Seems to be a portal in here. Ah, oh, nice smooth transition there. Oh, there's an elevator. Yeah, very interesting graphically looking, for sure. Let's see... Yeah, why not? Let's see... Uh, options. Add a little bit of a... Still have a sharp, but a bit of smooth to the edges of the stuff here, right? Oh, that's uh, another teleport. Looking cool. I like this effect. Let's F1 to see how. I have always run on. Okay. This must two to... Okay, I wasn't able to read that, but that's fine. Wee wee! Right, little beast of fury. Oh yeah, gone. Mouse two to shoot secondary fire. Okay, 
that's a short shot. We have 169 bullets. Can't break that. Map here? Can't move the map around. I can move my mouse. Okay. I feel like the biggest thing for me with the map here in general is that this arrow needs to be a, a different looking, like a bigger icon, something more than just the arrow. And we have the same, alright, it's using the same like this. Using the same like in Helsinger, yes, uh, I think it was... Day Zane or Day Zim, Day Zim, that first they might try two days ago here. Uh, you just press F6 and it saves, and I do really like that. Let's move it up with my melee. It can be quite interesting to see what's a door and what's not a door. <laughs> I think it's a very, very interesting art style here. Oops. Took a little bit too much damage there. Or it feels good. Right. Can I change to options for mouse? Pressure, swap, mouse. Here we can go. Oh, that's a big one. <laughs> oh my goodness, okay. Uh, where do we have this one? Is it the HUD option? All right. jump but it seems very not not a vertical game so far Ooh, that's a nice this weapon felt really nice Alright, you have unlimited ammo to try this one out here. So, so let's see, yeah. Fist of Fury, Pistol, Shotgun. It might be a little different, hard to tell right away the difference, especially between these two, which one is which. There is a difference, it's not a huge difference. I don't know if that can be tweaked or not. I like that it's auto fire, so you don't have to keep pressing here to fire. 
Did I get that? I guess so. Uh-oh. Nice, I like the sound effects. <laughs> Very retro, nice, wide feeling. Not sure why I have fists as the entire own weapon. I much prefer if they were more focused on just firing. And another weapon, a grenade launcher. Quite some... Quite a lot of... a lot of different guns. Some of maybe a little bit underwhelming. Another weapon? Oh my goodness. That's a lot of weapons you get to try in this demo. Okay, plasma rifle, sounds nice. Demo really gave you a lot of weapons to try quick here. Cannot jump out? Oh, I probably could have done that, alright. The easy difficulty feels nice and balanced for easy. I also think that you don't really need to have open, you can just have activate by touching. I wonder if that thing that they drop is its ammo for this gun. Okay, so you can go up a little bit of verticality. That doesn't seem to give me a lot of 
lot of uh, reason to do so, but yeah. Alright, might be this one that gives gets ammo from that. Yeah, that's good. <laughs> nice little battle ruina. I really like this. Like the art style, I like how it feels uh, very different than um, many other games like this. Uh, just it would be nice to just activate it by just touching it. I feel I need the open button here. It's not, you know, by making this uh, like the first game I tried to do, so it's more of narrow. It's even if it's not filled with stuff, it still feels uh, pretty good. Since you get, uh, don't have to fill it when it's just not so much space to fill. So. I don't remember where to go, unfortunately. Or oh, know where I'm supposed to go. Not in the skybox. Not sure where I'm supposed to be going. Oh! Interesting. Ah! <laughs> uh, that was a fun uh, little secret. <laughs> I like that. It was fun. Yeah. Um, where am I supposed to go from here? Find a switch. This map is probably not going to help me that much. Bim? What am I missing? He's like I'm supposed to go with just straight ahead, but that's not the case since I've already done all of this. Okay, this map is a bit confusing to me right now. What am I missing? This probably should like hurt me, I feel like. It doesn't hurt me, but I know something else tells me that it feels natural that it should. <laughs> I'm very confused where I'm supposed to go. 
I don't know, this map it doesn't really give me a lot of things to go by. I can't really tell what's a door and what's not a door, so the map uh, really... Oh, this just recalls it. Okay. Like, it should be up here. I feel this is the most natural thing to go. It runs great though, and you know, it, this, it does feel really great. <laughs> yeah, I, I went in here already. And this map, I don't know, I don't know. <laughs> Secret is real, but... Okay, so this is the end, but I can't go further. Um, I might have to quit this demo here, because I don't know where to go. Quite confusing. It's uh, super confusing to me. We are started, right? Maybe? Maybe not exactly where I started. This is very far back. I'm so confused. Um, yeah, if I can't find my way out, I'm gonna just you know, stop the demo here, but it was really great up until now. I just don't know where. If I'm missing a switch, I don't know which switch, where to go, I don't know. Confusing. All right, so this is where I end up. Is this a new era? Uh, or no, new place? No, is this one? Oh no, this is new. Okay, I'm, I'm not sure how I got here. Uh, let's do this. Okay, I, I guess I should have gone right. I went left and forward all the wrong ways. <laughs> not sure about this map. This map does not help me at all. has been open, okay. We get lots of ammo.
I guess I'm invincible. I probably should have used that for this part. <laughs> Very doom and light, right? The invincibility there. Oh shit. I love this. That was so cool. <laughs> that uh, everything freezes, but uh, but you and your projectiles there. That's uh, really cool. That's cool with this little verticality here. You can like peek up. Maybe you can even jump out off to the side, it might be secret. Nice little weapon room here. Yeah, this seems really cool, man. Oh, just like in the Doom. <laughs> uh, It's 
almost like a nicer, colorful uh, Doom game. <laughs> Infinite ammo of machine gun. Oh, I could have asked when. Da, 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 da. Length of a demo. Oops. Do 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 Get, uh, that is, I like the portal vibe here. I feel the demos should be probably over soon here. All three keys. Oh, was that just the first part? Crazy. And I went into this one, right? Wow. Well, I think it's a good, good, good chunk demo to show off, right? I don't think I need to show the entire demo for this one. So that's one. Huh. Or did I go to the same? Wait, wait a minute! I done this. Can I go back? I can't. Is the enemies respawning? Because I did this already. No, no, they're already broken. So... Oh no. Can you... No, you can't. I would have to use my save file. Um... Where is this? Okay, this is this. So if I then go this way, I need all the three keys to open this door. I'm just curious to see. Is this a new era? Oh, this is new area. Okay, but I think this is good showcase of the demo. I'm gonna finish this for sure. I don't think I need to go off the rest of this here. Um. Yeah, Mala Pektaka. Uh, <laughs> really interesting. It's just a little bit with the map that is maybe could have maybe tweaked or something. I don't know. So threw me off a little bit. Other than that, uh, way cool stuff here. So I highly recommend you checking out if you like this this type of game and stuff like that. Plays really nice and. Uh, like the music, like the art style, everything fits there. The gun mostly feel kind of, you know, retro cool style. So yeah, I'm going to put this on my wish list to keep an eye on it. Uh, they <laughs> it was really, really interesting. Uh, quite interesting that it's, it's uh, quite a bit of heavy to record as compared to... Uh, like the previous game and stuff like that. I don't know why. It seems a very simple graphic, but all right. Uh, follow if you want to see me play some more. I think I might do GoldenEye. Let's try two coming up. GoldenEye 007 for the PlayStation 3 coming up. And uh, yeah, leave a comment if you want, a like if you want, or just uh, have a great day till next time. Bye.